in this question, we're looking at an arithmetic sequence. So, I mean, here they say that we have an arithmetic sequence where the first term is 3, and we're told that the second term is 7. I think first it helps to know what a sequence is. A sequence is just a list of numbers separated by a comma, and they don't necessarily have to have a pattern. But what makes it arithmetic is important. If it's arithmetic, it means there's a common difference. And that is what we call D. That common difference means you're always adding the same number, and you can add a negative number. So for example, if you had 1, then you had 3, then you had uh, 5, then you had 7, then you'd always be adding, uh, for example, 2. Right? If you added 2, 1 plus 2 is 3, 3 plus 2 is 5, 5 plus 2 is 7, and so on. So you can always be adding a negative as well. You can add a positive. So this D, that's actually what we're looking for in this first part. So part A, we want to know what's the common difference. And the common difference we write as the letter D. Uh, so let's write that down. And we're told that uh, this arithmetic sequence, the first term is uh, 3, sorry, and the second term is 7. Dot, dot, dot. So if we look at this then, let's look at the common difference. The common difference is just simply done by doing 7 minus 3. In other words, take any term and subtract from it the term before it. So in this case right here, we can go 7 minus 3, and that should be, well, that's 4. So that means then a common difference, d equals 4. This is what we need in order to do this question here. 